welcome you back to Black Side Sports tonight. We're going to talk about WNBA player Natasha Cloud calling America trash. First, I would like for you to subscribe to this channel, hit that like button, hit that notification button, but also comment on this video. If anybody wonder why the WNBA is the most unpopular league in America, just look at what their players are saying. Natasha Cloud said that America was trash after a Supreme Court decision that went against the LGBTQI community. She actually said it, a country that's given you an opportunity to play sports a professional sport and make a lot of money, but America is trash. Because a Supreme Court decision did not go this way, if it's trash, Go somewhere else where you can live that is so perfect, but you still here in America. See, these athletes in the WNBA who cry about not having charter flights, who cry about equal pay, this is what they say, and they expect for us to support their league. People like her, Brittany Griner, Sue Bird and so many others who have played in the WNBA have to understand it's about marketing. It's about selling a product. But since they are all woke and part of the woke agenda, they forget that half of the country is not going to support their nonsense. And not even a percentage of this country is supporting the WNBA. This is a league right now which is basically held up by the NBA and uh, Adam Silver. But Natasha Cloud comes out here, says what she says, and expect the American public to support her. The Supreme Court gave the right for legal marriage. That's the same Supreme Court that had this decision. They'll go your way or they'll go somebody else's way. That's how the Supreme Court is. And you have to understand that's how America is. You still have the right to do whatever you want to do. You may not can go to that bakery because of their religious rights to turn you down. But that don't mean America is trash. See, the problem I have with the woke community in America is that they believe personally that everything should be perfect. It's not going to be perfect. It's not going to be perfect for the LGBTQI community, the black community, the Asian community, the Jewish community. But this is what they want. Constant, constant agitation. So she actually thinks that people who go to her Twitter account, those who happen to be on the left, those who happen to be on MSNBC, yes, they will support her, but the people that you need to make your league popular is not coming to your games. The people that you need to raise your salary is not coming to your games. The people you need to support this league is not coming to your games because of this type of attitude. And this has been fostered by our politics. Some things should be kept said and not heard. And that's the problem with Natasha Cloud. She made a huge mistake. And this mistake is going to cost the WNBA. They just had Brittany Griner over in Russia. She finally stands for the national anthem. But here's Natasha Cloud coming up, destroying whatever little credibility that this league has with the American public. So she's basically destroying the league from within. I want to thank you for listening to Black Site Sports. Hope you subscribe to this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.